Have you ever wondered if you had a time machine? Where would you go? Back to the past to witness history, or forward into the future to see the unknown? Time travel. It's a concept that has captivated our collective imagination for centuries, from H.G. Wells' groundbreaking novel, The Time Machine, to the iconic DeLorean of Back to the Future. It's a staple in science fiction, a tantalizing possibility that has been explored in countless books, films, and TV shows. But why are we so fascinated by this idea? Perhaps it's the allure of rewriting our past or the thrill of peeking into the future. Or maybe it's the sheer audacity of defying the laws of nature, of bending time to our will. But at the heart of our fascination with time travel is a deeper, more profound question. What is time? In our everyday lives, time seems straightforward. It's a constant flow, a relentless march from the past, through the present, and into the future. But delve a little deeper, Venture into the realm of physics, and you'll discover that time is a far more complex and enigmatic phenomenon. Einstein, one of the greatest minds in the history of science, proposed that time isn't separate from space, but intertwined with it in a four-dimensional fabric known as space-time. And just like a fabric, space-time can be stretched and warped, giving rise to the tantalizing possibility of time travel. So, how does time travel work? Is it even possible? And if it is, what kind of mind-bending paradoxes might it unleash? These are some of the questions that have puzzled scientists and philosophers alike for decades, questions that we will attempt to unravel in this journey into the enigma of time travel. So let's dive into this fascinating concept and unravel the mysteries of time travel. Time travel, in its simplest form, is moving between different points in time, just as we do in space. Imagine you're on a road trip. You start at point A, your home, and you're heading to point B, maybe that's your favorite beach destination. The distance between these two points is the space you travel. Now, imagine if point A is today, and point B is 10 years ago, or maybe 10 years in the future. The distance between these two points is the time you travel. Just like we move through space in three dimensions, up and down, left and right, forward and backward, time is considered the fourth dimension. We're constantly moving through time, but only in one direction forward. We age, we grow, we change, all in a forward motion through time. But what if we could change that? What if we could move backward through time, or skip forward at a faster rate? Think about hopping on a plane. You're in New York, and you want to get to London. You board the plane, fly across the Atlantic, and in six hours, you're in a different place. Now imagine if you could do the same with time. You're in 2024, and you want to get to 1984. You hop in a time machine, press a few buttons, and in six hours or six minutes or even six seconds, you're in a different time. But unlike our road trip or plane ride, where we know the route we're taking, time travel is a little more complicated. We don't yet have a map of time, no GPS to guide us through the years. And while we have theories and ideas about how time travel might work, we're still figuring out the mechanics of it all. So time travel isn't just a sci-fi trope or a plot device in movies, it's a real concept, rooted in physics and the nature of our universe. It's a fascinating field of study, filled with possibilities and paradoxes. Now that we have a basic understanding of what time travel is, let's venture into the theories that make it possible or impossible. When we talk about time travel, we cannot ignore Einstein's theory of relativity. This theory, divided into special and general relativity, revolutionized our understanding of time, space, and gravity. Let's start with special relativity. Einstein proposed that the laws of physics are the same for all non-accelerating observers, and that the speed of light is the same no matter the speed or direction of the observer. This means time can slow down or speed up depending on how fast you move relative to something else. This is known as time dilation. Imagine you're on a spaceship traveling close to the speed of light. To you, time seems normal, but when you return to Earth, you'd find that much more time has passed than you experienced. This is called the twin paradox a thought experiment demonstrating time dilation. Now let's move to general relativity. Einstein proposed that massive objects cause a distortion in space-time, which we perceive as gravity. The more massive an object, the more it bends space-time. This bending of space-time isn't just spatial, it also affects time. That's right, gravity can bend time. Near a massive object, time runs slower. This was confirmed by GPS satellites, they have to adjust their clocks to account for the fact that time runs faster in space than on Earth. So, what does this mean for time travel? According to general relativity, if we could create a space-time path that takes us back to a point in our own past, we could travel in time. 
Theoretically, this could be achieved through wormholes, bridges through space-time. However, it's important to note that these are just theories. We don't have a spaceship that can travel at the speed of light, and we haven't found a wormhole to test these theories. And even if we could, there are other obstacles to overcome like the energy required and the potential for catastrophic consequences. So, the theory of relativity gives us a glimpse of hope for time travel, but it's not as simple as it seems. While the theory of relativity might suggest the possibility of time travel, it also introduces us to the paradoxes associated with it. Now, what is a paradox? In simple terms, it's a situation that defies intuition and logic. Time travel, as fascinating as it may be, is riddled with these paradoxes. Let's explore two of the most famous examples, the grandfather paradox and the bootstrap paradox. The grandfather paradox is a classic. Imagine you invent a time machine and decide to travel back in time to meet your grandfather before he had any children. What if, in a twist of fate, you accidentally cause his demise? If your grandfather didn't survive to have children, your parent wouldn't be born, and neither would you. But if you were never born, how could you have traveled back in time to cause your grandfather's untimely end? This is the grandfather paradox, a loop that seems impossible to reconcile. Similarly puzzling is the bootstrap paradox named after the phrase, pulling yourself up by your bootstraps. Picture this. You're a scientist who invents a groundbreaking scientific theory. One day, a future version of you shows up with a notebook containing the details of that theory. You copy the details down, and it becomes the theory you're known for. But here's the question. Where did the theory originate? If you copied it from your future self, and your future self learned it from you, who came up with it in the first place? These paradoxes challenge the feasibility of time travel. They suggest that if time travel were possible, it could result in logical inconsistencies that defy our understanding of cause and effect. This doesn't necessarily disprove time travel, but it certainly complicates it, highlighting that our understanding of time and its mechanisms might be more complex than we currently comprehend. These paradoxes certainly complicate our understanding of time travel, but let's not lose hope just yet. The enigma of time travel continues to captivate us. And who knows, we might just be on the cusp of a breakthrough that will unravel these paradoxes and open the door to the future or the past. Beyond the realm of classical physics, in the quantum world, we find another potential gateway to time travel. Wormholes. Now, what exactly is a wormhole? Imagine folding a piece of paper in half and then pushing a pencil through it. The pencil in this case represents a wormhole a shortcut through the fabric of space-time. Theoretically, a wormhole could connect two different points in space and time, making it possible to traverse vast distances in the blink of an eye or perhaps even travel through time. The concept of wormholes comes from the field of quantum mechanics, a branch of physics that deals with phenomena on an incredibly small scale, like atoms and subatomic particles. Quantum mechanics is a realm where the impossible becomes possible, where particles can be in two places at once and where time might flow backward. According to some interpretations of quantum mechanics, there's a chance that wormholes could exist naturally on these tiny scales, as fleeting microscopic tunnels in the quantum foam of space-time. But don't pack your bags for a time-traveling adventure just yet. While these quantum wormholes might be popping in and out of existence all around us, they are far too small and unstable for anything larger than a particle to pass through. However, physicists have proposed that it might be possible to capture and enlarge one of these quantum wormholes, stabilizing it with a form of exotic matter that defies our everyday understanding of physics. This exotic matter would have negative energy, which might sound strange, but is allowed under the peculiar rules of quantum mechanics. So, could we use wormholes for time travel? In theory, yes. If we could create and manipulate a stable wormhole, it could potentially act as a bridge to another time. But there's a big question mark over whether this is practically achievable. We don't yet have the technology or understanding to create a stable wormhole, and the exotic matter required to keep a wormhole open might not even exist in a form we can use. So, wormholes could potentially be our ticket to time travel. But are they really practical? Even if we could time travel, should we? This question propels us into the realm of the practical and ethical considerations surrounding time travel. Let's first look at the practical challenges. The energy requirements for time travel are, to put it mildly, astronomical. According to some theories, creating a wormhole large enough for a human to pass through would require the energy equivalent of several stars. And that's just to create the wormhole. Keeping it stable and traversable is another Herculean task entirely. 
Therefore, the practicality of time travel seems far beyond our current technological capabilities. But let's say, for argument's sake, we overcome these hurdles. We invent a super-efficient energy source, devise a method to stabilize wormholes, and voila, we have a time machine. What then? This is where ethics comes into play. Time travel presents a minefield of ethical dilemmas. For instance, if you could travel back in time and change an event, should you? What are the consequences of altering the past? The butterfly effect warns us that even small changes in the past can drastically alter the future in unpredictable ways. This could potentially lead to erasure of individuals or entire civilizations from existence. Moreover, who gets to decide what events should be changed? The decision to alter history could easily fall prey to personal biases, potentially rewriting history in a way that favors certain groups over others. This brings us to the question of control and regulation. Who would have access to time travel technology? Who would regulate its use? These are complex questions that we need to grapple with if we ever hope to make time travel a reality. As you can see, time travel is a complex and fascinating topic that continues to captivate us. But as with any technological advancement, it comes with its own set of challenges and ethical implications. Whether we'll ever be able to, or indeed should, time travel remains a question for the future. So, where does all this leave us in terms of time travel? At this point in our journey, we've dissected the enigma of time travel, delved into its theoretical underpinnings, and even grappled with its paradoxes. We've danced with Einstein's relativity and waltzed through the wormholes of quantum mechanics. We've pondered on the practicality and ethics of time travel, but what does the future hold for this fascinating concept? Currently, the study of time travel exists predominantly within the theoretical realm. Scientists and researchers are tirelessly probing the mysteries of our universe, hoping to uncover the secrets of time. Theoretical physicists are making strides in understanding the nature of space-time while quantum mechanics continues to pose intriguing possibilities. Yet, there are still many unanswered questions. For instance, we still grapple with the nature of time itself. Is it a fundamental aspect of our universe or merely a construct of human perception? How does time relate to space at the quantum level? These are some of the mysteries that future research aims to unravel. Advancements in technology could potentially play a pivotal role in our understanding of time travel. For example, quantum computers, with their ability to process vast amounts of data, could provide new insights into the complexities of quantum mechanics and its implications for time travel. In addition, ongoing research in fields like string theory and dark energy could also shed light on the potential for time travel. These areas of study may help us understand the fabric of the universe on a deeper level, possibly opening doors to new dimensions of time and space. While time travel remains a captivating concept, it is, for now, confined to the realms of science fiction. But who knows what the future holds? The pursuit of knowledge is an endless journey, and as we continue to explore the mysteries of the universe, we may yet find that time travel is more than just a flight of fancy. While time travel remains a captivating concept, it is, for now, confined to the realms of science fiction. But who knows what the future holds? So, that's a whirlwind tour of the fascinating world of time travel. We've unraveled the enigma, delved deep into understanding its concept, and explored the mind-bending theory of relativity that underpins it all. We've navigated through the paradoxes that time travel presents, and peered into the mysterious realm of wormholes and quantum mechanics. We've also pondered the practicality and ethics of time travel. Can we, should we, alter the past or the future? And what would be the consequences of such actions? We've looked ahead to the future of time travel, contemplating its possibilities and potential advancements. Every exploration, every discovery, every hypothesis brings us a step closer to understanding the complexities of time and our place within it. We've journeyed across the expanse of time, from the dawn of the universe to the farthest reaches of the future, and yet, the mystery remains. Whether we will ever be able to travel through time remains a question for the future. But one thing is for sure, the journey to find out is going to be an exciting one.